tempest. On a lonely land, there lived a wise old man, Prospero, and his daughter, Miranda. She was only 16 years of age. Prospero was a magician. Prospero, by his magic, rescued the spirits of the island from the wicked Sycorax. So, these spirits obeyed the words of Prospero. The chief of these was Ariel, who was very true to Prospero. One day, Prospero saw a ship coming at a long distance. Prospero, by his magic, raised a fearful storm. Miranda was shocked to see this. Father, what are you doing? If you raise a storm, the people in the ship will have to lose their life. Nothing will happen, Miranda. Uh, but... I have raised a storm only for you, Miranda. You do not know who you are and where you come from. That means? The time has come for me to tell the truth to you. Miranda, 12 years ago, I was the Duke of Milan. You are my only daughter. I was very much interested in learning magic. So, I left my dukedom to my brother Antonio. But, he joined the King of Naples and robbed my dukedom from me. Why did they not put us to death? My people loved me very much. So, he did not kill us. I'm sorry, my father. I have talked very much without knowing what has happened. Do you know why I created this storm? In that ship, there are my enemies. My brother Antonio and the King of Naples. I'm going to meet them face to face. Prospero, by his magic, made his daughter fall asleep. Then, he showed his magic stick towards the empty air and talked something. After some time... Is all done well, Ariel? Yes, my master. The ship seemed likely to sink. Ferdinand, the son of King of Naples, had fallen into the sea. But I have saved him and led him on the rocks. Ferdinand thinks that his father had died. And King of Naples thinks that his son would have died. But the truth was both of them are safe. Well, Ariel, you go and bring Ferdinand here. My daughter must see him. Where are my brother Antonio and King of Naples? The ship they came is not damaged at all. I have left them far away at sea, where it can't be seen. After some time, Miranda saw Ferdinand. Both of them were very much in love with each other. Then, Ariel, what is the condition of my brother Antonio and King of Naples? <laughs> I gave them the most delicious food. When they were going to eat, I made the food disappear from their side. They were suffering very much in hunger. I reminded them that this is the punishment for them for their evil treatment towards you. Now they feel very sad for their behavior. Bring them immediately here. Ariel brought Antonio and King of Naples. King, please forgive us. I will surely forgive you. I'm going to show you something too. Prospero opened the door and showed them Ferdinand playing chess with Miranda. King of Naples and Ferdinand were very joyous to find each other alive. All of them were happily having their food. At that time, Ariel said to Prospero that, Master, my duty was over. So... Yes, I understood. Thank you, my king. Ariel flew away singing the pretty song. All of them happily saw that. The storm that was raised by Prospero ends in well. <laughs>